what is going on guys so today i wanted to show you guys a tutorial i know you guys have been asking for this just because a lot of you guys have been having a little bit of problems with uh brute force save data just uh being able to convert the regions but i just want to set things straight and finally fix it all for you guys so first thing you want to do is download brute force save data the link will be in the description below it is the latest version at 4.7 um inside of actually this this file save if you can see on the screen here inside of the file save you should see a msvbm50 exe executable um that actually is a runtime it's a part of the system of the actual windows that you're using and if you don't install that first or even after Brute Force Save Data will automatically give you this error saying you you're having you know msvsbm missing from your computer try reinstalling the program to fix you actually don't need to reinstall the program just double click on that msvsbm and just let it do its thing uh do you want to install vb runtime just press yes let it do its thing completed successfully and now if you were to go back and actually let's just put it installed correctly uh now if you were to actually go into brute force save data and double click on it and there you go it'll ask you to download one more thing just press yes let it do it its thing one more time it'll actually bring you to this website so say if you're actually missing these files what i suggest is just to let them download it for you um, all of this is actually from the microsoft website um, just let it download see i'm using google chrome here it's zero seconds left this is actually part of Visual Basic. Visual Basic is a is a tool that people use to develop applications for Windows. And if you don't have the specific uh, files that you would need, you actually can't run the the programs that are actually made with Visual Basic. So after that's completed, just press Finish and X out the window. Then what you're going to want to do is this program installed correctly once again, and then go and launch Brute Force Save Data. There you go, there you have it. It'll ask you if you'd like to install some cheats. Checks it out for the beginning. Then it'll ask for your profile information. You could press close. And you don't have to configure it now. You guys can do that later. But uh, it should be working perfectly fine. If you guys do have any problems, feel free to leave me a question or a comment in the comment section below. And if you guys did enjoy this tutorial, please leave me a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Alright, peace. <laughs>